going on everybody welcome back to a, another podcast here at sales guys unlimited sales growth Fred here alongside kevin and uh we're back again another episode um where we want to touch on some uh, closing techniques some objections uh, sure. last week we um, went over kind of some trial, trial closing, closing. And we're going to yep. continue mm-hmm. um you know to go through that stuff obviously there's a lot of different ones out there um so we're going to do some kind of uh, role playing today on that mm-hmm. um Thank you for uh, all the people too following our uh, Instagram, YouTube yeah. channel, a couple yeah. more subscribers. Uh, as we continue along, please yeah. uh, like, share, follow. Uh, if you do have any questions, you can always, uh, always email us at uh, salesguys.unlimited at uh, gmail.com. Mm-hmm. And then, uh, as always, you can follow our Instagram page uh, at uh, salesguys underscore, <coughs> excuse me, unlimited growth. Uh, as we'll have uh, constant updates on there and some uh, little uh, video snippets and. Um, Eventually do some live feeds, some uh, guest speakers too, yep. coming up um, possibly next week or the week after that. Mm-hmm. Uh, so today we want to just dive in some things help you to uh, close some sales um, and things we do in the home uh, to address those uh, different types of uh, situations. Sure, so, sure. Yep. Um, I don't know if you want to add some stuff. Too, yeah, good uh, morning guys. Uh, happy Friday. Uh, it's been a great sales week. Uh, Fred and I, uh, you know, and what we do had uh, some really successful weeks. Uh, a lot of this practice and kind of banter has held us really accountable uh, to our own sales process, which I love. Um, I'm really enjoying the journey. Fred and I are uh, super excited about what we're doing here. And, um, you know, as uh, Fred touched on last week, we explored some trial closing. Um, what we want to cover today is really um, predominantly the bigger three objections that we see. Um, so as we role play through it, I'll be uh, asking Fred just, you know, really how he overcomes those objections, what he might see or, you know, questions he might ask to probe a little further and really get out the information that we need in order to execute and get further down, you know, right to the uh, to the time of sliding that pen across the table and asking for the signature. So a uh, mm-hmm. lot of fun here. And um, Fred, with that, I mean, you want to, we'll get right into it, huh? Yeah, yeah. Um, so big things, you know, as uh, you have different objections, we were talking mm-hmm. before, just kind of which ones come up the most. Um, mm-hmm. uh, for me, um, the one uh, way to really overcome any objection mm-hmm. uh, is you don't ask for a yes or a no. Right. Uh, you put the pen to Keep paper. it open-ended. Yeah, yeah. well, just put, yep. at, the, at the end of the sale, um, mm-hmm. I'm big on basically, a, you know, what I would call something closing. Okay, yeah. So, yep. Um, yep. you know, say you... You, at you the, want to define that for our followers and listeners, you know? Uh, uh, so, so basically assuming the sale, um, you know, we don't use those, uh, what we call in the industry, the three power closes that most guys use where they say, uh, you know, what do you think, huh? Um, it's, you know, one or mm-hmm. uh, you want to yeah. go ahead yeah. um, or yeah. uh, how's that sound? Mm-hmm. Um, if you're using those types of closes, those are, you know, pretty much guaranteed to get you, you know, think over. Right. Um, and again, it's asking the customer for a yes or a no. Right. Um, as we continue through the process, you might have objections. Yeah. Um, and you're, again, you're not going back to a yes or no. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, Zig Ziglar said people don't change their minds. Uh-huh. They make new, new decisions off new information. So it's basically... Yeah. That's a pretty it, powerful little nugget there. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah like You know, that. because yeah. it, it, I'm not, once their mind's made up, yeah. but now you just gave them a new decision, you didn't ask them the same question over again. Correct. Um, so those are, you know, again, through that process. Mm-hmm. Um, assuming the close is basically once I'm finished, mm-hmm. you know, that's great. You know, say it comes down to it and... Um, you know, customer, I just say, you know, for the roof project and, mm-hmm. the, you know, the color you like and everything else. And sure. uh, we could start next Wednesday. Well, I need you to do is just sign here and there. Yeah. And I literally just That's flow right. right into it Sure. Uh, from there. And then mm-hmm. at that point is where, you know, you might get uh, your first objection. Mm-hmm. Um, Would you say, like, if, if, if you receive that objection about, you know, on average, do you, do you receive a couple of no's maybe before you get that yes? Uh, oh, yeah, absolutely. Okay. I would say mm-hmm. um, for me... You know, it, it depends on the, the situation, right. um, but I, you know, most uh, uh, people or through studies, they say it takes the average pro about, you know, four or five times, wow. or it could take about okay. four or five times mm-hmm. um, till you close the sale. Right. So a lot of individuals, maybe they give up. Sure. Or again, you know. Or get down. discouraged by it and yeah. really kind of shut up, you know, shut down really yeah. and just think, kind of, think like, back okay, uh, you know, take your time, you know, you could think about it. Oh, no, hold on a second, yeah. you know, let's, um, let's re-explore and keep it absolutely. fluid. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Okay. Yeah. No, you... Mm-hmm. Um, you know, at the end of the day, you, you still might not get the sale, but yeah. there's, you know, but if you do a good job, you know, mm-hmm. they might come back to you. But, right. you know, mm-hmm. let's say, you know, in the high percent, you know, maybe 60, 70 percent of the time, most of the people are not going to call you back. Right. Uh, because they go through the process and maybe the next guy comes and, you know, all the pricing so close. Right. And then they're just like, okay, you know, just do it anyway. And, right. and that's a, one of 
mm -hmm. you know, the sales kind of techniques are used too. After an yeah. injection is we tell the people, you know, listen, we would love to come back. Sure. You know, and see you again. When I'm, you know, unfortunately with my scheduling and your scheduling, I'm, mm -hmm. I'm sure your time is very important to you, you know, yes. and, which is, um, you know, not saying like, I can't come back here, but you right. know, your time is important to you just as my time is important to me. Yes. Um, and to make another trip, mm -hmm. you know, we might have to cancel another appointment. Right. And, you know, we'll do whatever it takes to earn your business, but we right. want to earn your business today. How, you know, how can we do that? Right. Sure. Um, and, uh, um, you know, through that process, again, mm -hmm. it, it's the, avoiding confrontation. Sure. Never asking for a yes or a no. Right. Um, you're asking them to make a decision on the information you provide it to them. Right. Uh, a good analogy is be like a tree in the wind, you know, mm -hmm. it rocks back and forth. Sure. If it stands tall, it's going to snap in half. Right. So fight versus flight, you know, mentality. Sure. You know, if, yeah. if, uh, that's a great analogy to kind of put in perspective what we do day in and day out and, yeah. and understand. Sure. Because customers yep. are defensive. You think mm -hmm. about, um, you know, in the wild, like, you know, if you're sitting out there, bird down on the porch, you open the door, what happens? You turns, you know, fly, you know, again, sure. the instant yep. reaction. If it's a a more aggressive animal or something mm -hmm. in the wild that's going to turn around and want to fight, you know, yeah. now you're causing friction, you're causing confrontation. Right. Um, yeah. So that's why I say be like a tree in the wind. Mm -hmm. My response to any objection, again, never handle the objection, would always be to a customer, you know, no problem. Right. So, um, you know, I know we talked before, say a customer says, um, you know, that's a little bit more money than I could afford. Okay. You know, no problem. You know, mm -hmm. I could understand that. Sure. Um, yeah. But just out of curiosity, you know, mm -hmm. we're at $150 a month. Um, what would you say would be a monthly uh, payment that you'd be able to, yeah. you know? Mm -hmm. That's support. a fair question, yeah. 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 And you're going to get an open-ended response to that, which is great. Correct. Yeah. Um, and I would say, oh, I'm not really sure, you know, mm -hmm. or, or um, you know, well, we were thinking around, you know, maybe $120 a month. Okay. And, um, you know, my, you know, I would say to them at that point, mm -hmm. you know, listen, John Mayer, <clears throat> John and Mary, you know, or whoever it is, yes. obviously it's kind sure. of a name that always flows. Uh -huh. um, um so we're at, you know, what you're saying is you love the product, you love the company. Mm -hmm. It's just a little bit more than you were thinking on a monthly basis. Sure. So we're at $150 a month. Sure. For around $120 a month, that would have been something that might have been a little bit more feasible. Sure. Um, mm -hmm. Had there been a way that we were able to do that, again, right. isolation. I love that tense. <laughs> I, lo I, you know, I don't know if anybody's picking up on that, but I love that tense. Had there been a way. Yeah. Removal of confrontation. I don't feel defensive. I don't feel like I'm forced into a decision. But you know what? I can ask. I can. The, the walls are down. I can yeah. ask you honestly and, and, and look for a response to that. So absolutely. So yeah. I, um, yeah. You know. So had there been a way that I was able to get you down to 120 a month, mm -hmm. you would have gone ahead and, and purchased the roof. You know, today right. or the windows or sure. you know whatever you're saying. So mm -hmm. again, you know, had there been a way, you know, mm -hmm. so not you know where a lot of sales guys there are gonna now they gave them that ammunition. The guys sure. are gonna say so. You know, if I could, if I could do for 120 bottles a month, you do for, you know, you're going to do it today, now, right. you're going to sign right. now. Sure. You know, again, so that they feel that aggression. It's sure. Really coming out and depending on the scenario, it might work, but mm -hmm. most of the time that's not going to work. So, right. you know, John, Mary, you love the product, you know, is what you're saying. You really mm -hmm. want to do business with us. It's just maybe a little bit more than, you know, you were thinking on a monthly basis, you know, had there other than them. And then also to go into that to. Uh, make the confirmation that there is no other issues, no, right? Uh, other than the monthly investment now. Mm -hmm. So I can't, you know, like, you know, if I can't, I can't save you any more more money. If I could have, I would have. Mm -hmm. But had there been a way, I would, you know, able to do that. What you're saying is you would have gone ahead and purchased mm -hmm. uh, the window siding and roofing today. Yeah. You know, and then boom, at that point, you can say, well, congratulations, we actually have. You right. know, this, a uh, different financing uh, a term or coming on, right. you know, going on, yep. or a different <laughs> financing term. Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, so congratulations and confirmation. Mm -hmm. I could get you, you know, $120 a month, which I know you said you could afford. Right. And I'd stick in my hand and right. say, I know you, I know you were yeah. sincere. Yes, when you, know? when you gave me that information. Yeah. Yep. When, so, yep. again, all those key things there, the way you speak it to them, past tense versus present tense. Um, mm -hmm. Isolation of obviously the monthly payment, sure. Um, confirmation of the company that they want to do business, mm -hmm. and then again, not you know when I go to shake, put the hand in paper, not like sure. you know you weren't lying to me, right? You know, saying I know you were sincere. Yeah. You know, by the way, when you know when can we measure the windows, sure. or however you want to flow into sure. that next sure. yep. uh, scenario of the yeah. sale itself. Yeah. Um, um, and would you say, sorry to interrupt you there, but would you agree that when looking at our needs assessment early on really set the tone? for your ability to give the customer what you felt was the best solution for them. And then now what you're doing is confirming all those uh, selections that they've made early on in the decision process to now avoid any objection later on. So you're closing escape patches as you progress through. Your needs assessment gives you the information. The uh, closing those escape patches gives you confirmation to then move forward to the next step in the sales process. Correct. Yeah. All those right. things, you know, it's yep. tying everything together yep. at the mm -hmm. end what we call 
you know, Massive will use that word a lot. Presentation yes. is really mm -hmm. making sure you check all the boxes uh, right. going through and following everything uh, along. And then, you, again, confirmation through the steps. So now at the mm -hmm. end, because ultimately, it, it's, you know, any walk of life or anything you buy always usually yeah. comes down to money. Mm -hmm. um, you know, there are some scenarios where maybe people would pay a little more. Maybe, you know, life sure. comfortability. Right. Uh, again, and the way you're speaking to people has a big mm -hmm. difference, too. Where, you know, yes. again, it's the way, you know, sales guys might be pushy or, mm -hmm. you know, the way they're demonstrating the product might yeah. be aggressive, mm -hmm. you know, That's you right. know, uh, some, you know, uh, sitting there before I even get to the price, mm -hmm. you know, I'll say to some people, you know, before I leave, you know, right. you know, today. And again, yeah. that's like, you know, watch yeah. relaxation. Yeah. Know, just got to leave. He hasn't yeah. given me a price yet. You yeah, know, yeah. You know, before yeah. I go, is there any, you know, anything else, um, mm -hmm. you know, I want to. Yeah. Again, back to the other process with that mm -hmm. before the price that I didn't cover that I, you know, that sure. I wanted to go into. Mm -hmm. And again, just making the you know comfortable uh, cu customer feel comfortable. Yes. Um, so, you know, again, too much money. Mm -hmm. If it comes out, you know, monthly payments, obviously, uh, we'll say an easier one. But mm -hmm. you know, if you have different financing terms that are out there, it's a, it's right. a great way to segue basically right, right. into it. Right. Um, always confirm, you know, other than the monthly investment. Is there any other reason you wouldn't right. have got? Again, you wouldn't have gone ahead and purchased. No. Uh -huh that you didn't purchase today. Right. Um, so now again, that's eliminating basically there, there is no, right. It's either full of it or right. Exactly. You know, because right. the way you're, you're not working, being honest with yeah. you. You're right. Um, exactly. And that happens too, mm -hmm. but at least we want to do our job through the process. Right. Um, so then, some, yeah. right. So I was just going to say, so as we segue into, you know, we, we've dealt with money today. Um, what do you, what do you come or how do you, um, react when customers say, you know what, I, I want to think about it. I want to think it over. You know, you get to that uh, point. Yeah, no problem. You know, okay. but, um, right. you know, John diffusing Mayer. the situation. Yeah, no problem. Yep. Yeah, like no that. Pro you know, mm -hmm. say no problem. You know, yep. I, I, you know, I can understand that. Mm -hmm. uh, but just out of curiosity, you know, what is it you have to think about? Right. Um, so again, now you go through, and then you don't mm -hmm. stop there. You do know, you, do you probe a little further, or do you let them give you the the, no. the information to help you overcome? Their, I would. Their I actually questions. keep flowing. So I would say, you know, no problem. I okay. can understand that. But just mm -hmm. out of curiosity, um, you know, what what is it that you want to think about? Mm -hmm. And then I'd segue right into. Um, you know, is it is it the windows um, mm -hmm. that we showed you? Is it yeah. the uh, you know the vinyl and the argon gas, you know, or whatnot? Is mm -hmm. it you know offering a lifetime warranty? Oh no, yeah. you know, for every, you know we love the windows. Mm -hmm. um, is it my uh, is it our company? Yes. You know the fact that we back everything and all our guys are you know process and all our installers are certified. Mm -hmm. Oh no, you know we love that. Yeah. Uh, is it me? Mm -hmm. You know, my, as an right. individual, my tech anything that I did. Oh no, you know we love you. It's great. Mm -hmm. And then again, what's left? Is it the right. money? Right. Well, you know, boom. So now if it comes down right. to again monthly payment or maybe price difference. Well you're at, you know, twelve thousand, we've had prices for ten thousand. Okay. So mm -hmm. um in that case, you know, again, clearly, you know, and you said before, you know, you love the product and a much better looking product than yeah. you know, what you've seen from other companies mm -hmm. out there. Yep. Um so now it's a two thousand dollar difference between the two. Right. Um so there's a lot of different ways you can do that, reduce to the ridiculous. Um yeah. You could go into your energy savings to combat that, you know, sure. on a monthly basis mm -hmm. over term. You know, how, you know, John Mary, um, you know, okay, so, you know, it's a little bit of a difference in price. Mm -hmm. um, uh, $2,000. How You know, how long do you think, you, you know, guys will be in the home? Yeah. Oh, you know, well, you know mm -hmm. probably not really sure, but, you know, at least 10 years. Right. You know, so, you know, if they say, you know, two, you know, $2,000 difference, so you're going to be in the home for at least 10 years. Right. Um, obviously, you agree. Uh, that this product and you mm -hmm. confirmed before that this was the best product for you. Solve all your basically, issues. you know, yeah. talking a two, you know two hundred dollar mm -hmm. difference, you know, um, uh, over the course of a ten year time frame. Right. Um, you know, on a, on a yearly basis, mm -hmm. you know, for two hundred dollars a year, and then you could break it down to right. divide that per by day. twelve. Right. You know, monthly per basement per day, you know, even, you know, per week, and then sure. you know, again, reduce to ridiculous. You yeah. know, for only a couple, of, you know, two or three dollars, you know, a day, or how many, mm -hmm. you know, whatever money difference it would be yeah um you know think about all the stuff you you know you buy on a daily basis for an extra right. you know mm -hmm. 200 hours a year you know wouldn't it be worth it to have the best you know right. windows for you sure um so that's another one to go into again deferring your product over mm -hmm. time the money back you know not only yeah. that you know mm -hmm. with windows or most of the things out there you're talking about energy saving yes um so you, you know money back in your pocket mm -hmm. um, so the windows are going to miss and right you know, maybe not in that time frame, pay for themselves, but you right. can deduct okay. that money off the total. That's another sure. uh, good way to do it as well, too. Mm -hmm. um, and then um, you could also uh, go into, um, 
the return in terms of resale. So, right. you know, goods, housekeeping, stuff like that. Or right. Companies, or know, a third party, you know. Yeah, win um, windows show high, yep. you know, kitchens are high, sodding, mm -hmm. you know, seven, between a 70, you know, return or 80, depending on the category in your right. local area, you can research those things. Mm -hmm. So, they're going to break, you know, break into that. Right. Um, right. So basically diffuse the situation as best you can to really get them to understand that it's not so much as get them fixated on that number, it's more get them off of that and, and really show yeah. them what the return might be, what the benefit to them is, uh, instead of just trying to harp and overcome and, and then try to look for a price drop or something like that. Because again, you don't want to compromise like we always talk about integrity. So when people do question us on that, we want to make sure that it's not immediately, let's go to the checkbook and see how do we drop this number down or go into the, you know, what would you be willing to give up, yeah. you know, which is unfortunate, you know, yeah, another means to in do the it. Industry. Yeah. yeah, no, like you want to go, you want to give, you never want to deviate from from your, you know, products or your company yeah. might have different product mm -hmm. offerings. You know, again, that might come down later on in that stage. Sure. Okay. You know, maybe, you know, that product. Now we do have different products. Yeah. So again, that gives you a segue. You know, whether Windows usually, you know, maybe a couple different options. Yeah. Um, sliding roofing, mm -hmm. I think, kind of all the same. And yeah. Depending on your, Similar, um, yep. you know, industry, but you know, okay, we we do love you and everything else. You know, okay, mm -hmm. well now. Even still, before we give up and leave, okay, yeah. we do have a little, you know, option. This is what's a little different about it. Okay. Um, and I don't think there's anything necessarily wrong with that because, you know, you have some clients that say, you know what, that, that is the best. Yeah. You know, but we can't, you, we still want to do the work with you and you mm -hmm. have this product, which is still, also a Windows of lifetime warranty and everything else. Just mm -hmm. maybe they don't, you know, remove certain things. Ultimately, mm -hmm. you want to try to close them out what you were giving them yeah. originally. But mm -hmm. again, it's also all options before you leave the house. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and then, um, but yeah. everything you've said today is really talking about continuing the conversation, keeping it fluid. How do we stay within the present? How do we stay there um, at that closing table to really get them to feel so comfortable? You've eliminated all those objections, and you just kept it fluid. You just kept talking with them. That's and that's really what it comes down to. Yeah, you know, and eliminating that confrontational uh, sort of air about the conversation. You know, which I love. Yeah, be yeah. relaxed. You know, no again, tree in the yeah. wind. It's you know, sure. You know, no problem. You know, guys. Oh, we don't want to think about it. Oh, why? You know, why? What do you have to think about? You right. Know, like, exactly. You know, they need. You know. Right. You become well every pack, other sales. Might as well just be pack it up and leave. Right. No, no right. problem. You know, now mm -hmm. again, you go through and you're asking to make a different decision on new information. New information. You know, again, so you, you know, isolation, you know, had there been a way, you mm -hmm. know, um, if, you know, you're aware of $50 a month, mm -hmm. you know, how, you know, is it, is it forty dollars a month too much? Is it twenty dollars a month too much? Right. You know, is it ten dollars a month too much? You know, sure. one man's floor is another man's ceiling. Yes. You know, how how high is high? You know, yeah. if you don't, if you stop, like if you're like, well, how much, you know, on a monthly basis, how much more is it than you want to spend? Mm -hmm. And they'll just say, well, it's more, you know, more than what we were, you know, they'll just kind of give you a short answer. Right. You know, so or like fifty is it twenty? Right. You know, they get, well, you're at one fifty. You know, if we mm -hmm. were thinking about one hundred and fifteen. Boom. Now you, you you have them. You have the ammunition locked, you need. Yeah, you right? have them locked yeah. in because. Yeah. Again, I know you were sincere, the confirmation, mm -hmm. you got through everything else. Um, you know, so those are big things, isolation, past tense, present tense, mm -hmm. isolate to whatever the objection is at that time. Right. Um, you know, but we're always trying it down to, you know, usually a monthly basis because yeah. through our financing options or, or maybe a particular sale that the company's yeah. running, sure. you know, that that's really where we can offer that incentive. Everybody wants to feel, you know, like they're, you know, getting something getting out of yeah. um, as well as getting your product and, and you know, Ultimately, when we leave, yeah. same thing, you know, really feedback to the customer, your windows, mm -hmm. your siding, your roofing. Yeah. You know, when I leave here, you know, today mm -hmm. and, uh, you know, whatever I get paid, you know, a week from now, mm -hmm. you know, you're still going to have your product, you know, five years from now, mm -hmm. 10 years from now, yes. you know, your product works for you, you know, 365 days a year, it's yeah. more, you know, in the morning, day, noon, yeah. and night. Yeah. So the value of what you're paying for mm -hmm. is so much greater yeah. than your cost difference or that monthly payment, right? Because it's never going to stop producing, you know, mm -hmm. for you. So, yeah. Um, yeah. you know, those would really be some of the key things uh, with those two closes. You know, objections in terms of monthly or price difference. Yeah. Um, and you know, I guess we'll continue. Um, mm -hmm. You know, continue on maybe uh, sure. next week with a couple more. Um, mm -hmm. You know, as we dive in. Um, it's a lot of different types of closes, obviously, to go over. So we'll try to do kind of week to week, yeah, maybe get yeah. two or three. No. Yeah. Um, Let our audience kind of digest it, maybe practice it, role yeah. play for that week, and then we'll get back into some more that they can really, you know, uh, insert into their arsenal. To, yeah, uh, to practice is key, too. Um, you know, mm -hmm. how do you get the corner of hole? You know, practice the, the uh, repetition. Again, everything that we're doing here and kind of telling you uh, yeah. or, or viewers um, you know, major league baseball players, uh, you know, hockey, yeah. any professional sport, you look at the best athletes in the world, yeah. sales, yeah. Um, you know, we are paid on our production. Mm -hmm. uh, if you're not practicing, 
if you're not reading it to what you're doing, then mm -hmm. you're not going to survive yeah. in this business. So, I mean, I, I, I talk with these terms, uh, you know, to my two-year-old son. Right. You know, I walk around and, and practice these things on, a, on an everyday basis. So mm -hmm. that's really the other key. Make sure that you're doing that stuff. So, mm -hmm. so it, it just has rolls to be right off the tongue. Yes, yep. it has yep. to be. It has to be um, reactionary. It mm -hmm. can't be thought out. Right. Um, you know, would you want to drive in a car with somebody that doesn't know how to drive or has to think about? Right. You know, or we can have the heart sur you know, surgeon. Or yeah. Do you know? Sure. Be like, oh, yeah, we, you know, we have a yeah. plenty of pro you know, we'll blow a couple of leads. We have a plenty of you know prospects. We'll eventually yeah. get it right. Right. Uh, through it, you know, mm -hmm. that that's where the people in our industry, it's you know, the top uh, ten percent, yeah. eighty percent of the money. Yeah. Uh, practice mm -hmm. repetition. Yeah. Um, whether it's on your, you know, wife, family members, you sure. know, all the time. Yeah. And um, as for that, I think it's valuable. I mean, as smooth as Fred is with his, you know, um, you know, uh, process, it's it's only through that hard work and dedication to know that it's going to pay off for you. Just as much as we're talking about investment to the customer, it's an investment in yourself to practice. I mean, you know, um, Fred and I are, you know, uh, big golfers, and you know, one of the things that we're doing, you know, maybe we we'll use a training age. So no matter whenever we're going to the, either the range or the or the you know uh, practice area there's always a means that you're putting something in place to help you get better so you know there's never an aimless practice therefore there's never an aimless lead that we go on yeah. we don't learn you know uh, on the fly we're practicing those things behind the scenes so that customer isn't the you know test pile or guinea pig you know yeah we're, we're you know we're yeah. going out there because we want to be as smooth as possible understanding and and really anticipating those objections because again that's the best way to, to overcome them is is avoid them in the first place so if you're doing all the right things that our, our process is, is very consistent you're going to avoid them a lot it, it happens but again we, the more equipped you are the better yeah you know like golf, you know we might have a good round of golf but then you're back out there looking for the next sure so in our industry it's the same thing mm -hmm. yeah you have to want to be the best at it you have to want to have the edge mm -hmm. um that's what we're trying to really uh, get out there is uh, mm -hmm. you know give you those yep. tools um you know so key takeaways of you know, mm -hmm. just practice you know, past tense, present tense, yeah. isolation. I love that. I think that's genius. Um, you know, yeah. and then maybe you do have that lead where, the, you know, it's just like, hey, this is probably not going anywhere. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's a great time to just, you know, practice it just to become comfortable talking about this stuff. Yeah. You know, the person, you know, again, it might be just might be disinterested right. or anything else. But They may never buy the product or yeah. service. They may never do anything. They may just think about it until forever and they might get 150 prices. But, you know what, that's where that's yeah. the perfect you segue to do that. Where, yeah. You know, dive in and you're just like, you know mm -hmm. what, I'm going to spend, you know, 40 minutes here. I'm going to try every quote. You know, quote yeah, in the book, right? And uh, you might get every no, but you know, then now it's repetitive. It becomes more comfortable, relaxed, yeah, exactly. because that's how you want to be, right? Um, so mm -hmm. uh, I hope you, you know, everybody enjoyed uh, today's uh, podcast, and um, you know, again, we'll continue reviewing, reviewing mm -hmm. uh, closings, different closes, uh, different situations, scenarios, mm -hmm. um, and then we're going to get into some product demos. Yes. Uh, for our particular field, uh, window starting roofing, we'll break down you know what we do and what makes us. Um, you know, uh, successful in those areas are uh, running mm -hmm. anywhere from 60 to 80% uh, uh, and above uh, close rates, uh, which are very mm -hmm. good. And, you know, we didn't get there by not practicing. Mm -hmm. So uh, we'll dive into that and uh, some yeah. guest speakers uh, coming up too. Yeah, I'm excited uh, for that So too. Uh, again, good. please like, uh, you know, like our uh, Instagram page, give us mm -hmm. a follow, uh, subscribe yeah. on YouTube, uh, keep yeah. up to date on all the uh, good yeah. things to come. Yeah. Uh, we appreciate it. Uh, have a great selling day. And, uh, Thank you. Yeah, thank, thank you, you very much. Yep. Have a great day, everyone. Thank you.